We're here with the professor. We're here at Lend Rock Golf Course. So you're just outside of Philly. It's not bad. The course opened officially in 2006. It's a link style with a lot of wind coming through it. And believe it or not, it's owned by the township. So a lot of planning went into this course. Hats off to the township. I would wonder how much the final price tag of this course is. It's gotta be a lot. We're gonna talk about the history, the changes that we had in management, and also the designer, the group of designers that helped build this golf course. Here. Well, the course, it was designed by Kelly Blake Morgan Golf Architects. A ton of golf architects came out there and built this course here. Years in planning, almost six years. Six years of planning, and then another three years of construction. And the course does play long at 7,000 yards from those back tees. And the biggest takeaway of this 18-hole golf course, bring your senior card because there's a big yard difference on all of these holes here with almost, I don't know, 150% more yardage from the back tees, which we highly recommend because you'll get your money's worth. It's not cheap. The difference is, is magnificent. If you're a senior over the age of 65, this is the golf course for you. You can go 118 yards from those, what is it, par four here, or you could play from those back tees with the Parfessor at 413 yards. There is a lot of wind here. Why'd I hit it that hard? Now the biggest change that we could find on this course was in 2019, April 2019, when it did change golf management. It went from Billy Casper Golf to Brown Golf Management. What was that? What was that? Let's go, come on, come on, be good. Yes! Of course, it has a driving range and also a huge clubhouse with banquets and other events. When you get here, you're not gonna show which one's the clubhouse. Just walk right into that first building. Right on that, I'm just gonna go on that line. I feel like that's the hole. Nice shot. But par three, and you got to put one out there. Back wind, so I'm going to go four iron. It's about 208. That's the shot. I'm going to be an ace. Come on. So Ron Holt, number six, a par five. Let's get a driver out there. I got away with it. That's a great miss. There's a big hill right in front of the green. Let's get a nice contact. That's the shot. Bogey, par three. I don't even know how far it is, but it just doesn't even matter. That's a ball. Oh, uh, there's water right over that hill. So you can't go too far right at all. I think that's enough. That's not a par. That's it. That's what I wanted, a little open face, not Reuben, golf ball. That's what I wanted to miss. All right, chance for birdie, just missed this. See if I can get one up there and over. That's what I wanted, but I gotta get it there. I've never seen a change like this of over 430 yards. From the back tees, which I'm gonna try to play, 654. But from those senior tees, I'm going with the assumption, gold ones, uh, the baby boomers, you're looking at 212 yards. Huge difference, huge difference there. It's almost like if you bought a house, for the baby boomers than if you bought a house now. All right, definitely need a drive here. 654 yards from those back tees. All right, golly, you really gotta put a... That's a duck hook. Ended up finding that golf ball, which turned on me on the right. It opens up here. I'm still 300 something yards. I'm gonna lay up with a four iron. That cloud's coming right through. Let's see if I can get this over. Oh, no. It's okay. So I've been deceived. I thought the hole was going straight. It does 
to, to the left, so I might have hit up on that group in front of me, but nevertheless, we have a golf shot here. In a winter roll. That's short. Go. That was a good shot. Though. Chance for par. It is going to break. I almost want to say pretty violently to the left. Let's see. Yep. And Len Rock Golf Course is not an easy course. If you're playing from those back tees, be prepared to lose some golf balls. Even with a great drive, you're still hitting 200 yards to get something close. Let's see if I can get one up there. And all, a lot of the greens are elevated as well. So you have to put a good swing on most of your shots. This should be a par four. All right, let's get one up there. I got crosswind too. I don't even think I can get there with this. It's a four iron. I'm not hitting anything more than that. Uh, out of my swing. Uh, definitely want to leave it on the right hand side. I think it could come back. So let's see if I can get one. If it runs hard off the bounce, it has a shot. It's really not that long, about 300 yards, the finishing hole, 330 to be exact. I figured just hit a little four iron up there. Let's see if we can finish. Just like that, missed it, but that's a good miss.